thesmartlocal.com. And I'm Chow, back for another Insta Walk with m and And today we're all the way east in... Tampines! You guys probably don't know this, but Tampines has changed tremendously since it began developing back in the early 80s. Mm -hmm. From the sand quarries of the past to the town it is today, I am so ready to find out what Tampines has to offer. Are you? I am! So, let's, let's go! go! First up are these towering HDB blocks located along Tampines Street 45. Now if you find them familiar, it's because they were featured in the Channel 8 series, Don't Worry, Be Happy, way back in the 90s. Have you seen the show, Zane? Uh, no. <laughs> but I'm not worried about taking a bad picture here because honestly, the entire estate is super Instagrammable. That's very true. So let's go take some pictures! Chow, are you feeling the minimalist vibes from these Tudor-inspired block of flats? Because I am. Eh, me too. Eh, <laughs> it's black and white, just like us. Oh yeah. But did you know that these blocks were actually a brick red colour before residents voted for their monochromatic paint job? Wow, good choice, residents of Tapanese. Chan Ling, photo director. Sorry. Okay, so everyone's sticking out their hands. The analog TV test screen facade of these blocks has become iconic to Tampines. And I love how it gives a very retro vibe to this neighbourhood. Okay, right now I have Brenda with me. Okay, so tell me, what is your favourite spot so far? My favourite spot is the, our first stop, Tampines Street 45. Yeah. Oh, I thought your favourite spot is next to me. <laughs> Open in 2011, Tampines Eco Green is an eco-friendly park that is unlike any other heartland park in Singapore. It is also a sanctuary for biodiversity, with many different species of birds and insects recorded here. Tampines Eco Green is an eco-friendly park that showcases different types of natural habitats such as the open grassland, freshwater wetlands and a secondary rainforest. And it's also a great place for visitors to enjoy the best of nature recreation. The park also features an eco-toilet. It's the first of its kind in Singapore that converts human waste into compost using wood shavings and bacteria. With its good ventilation system, it's designed to be odour-free and waterless. Besides the eco-toilet, all the park furniture such as the signage, benches, bird heights and hedges were made using recycled materials. Lastly, within the park, there are also three different hiking trails, namely marsh, diversity and forest. These trails allow visitors to discover an array of flora and fauna and to experience nature. Tampanese Green Ridges is the first completed project in Tampanese North. Other than its distinctive architectural features, its many green spaces around provide residents with a sense of tranquil living in a park. While we're at the roof garden, we're clocking in a daily dose of workout! Right behind us is Tampanese Cultural Hub. Now this combination of a circular walkway and metallic sculpture offers the residents here yet another location for recreation and relaxation. It is the brainchild of Team Design Architects who won the largest Neighbourhood Renewal Program competition organised by Tampanese Town Council. And today it is being used as a platform for various community events but if you're like us, we are here to take some cool Instagram photos. Every time someone sits down and poses for a photo, right, this, is what, this is what they see. <laughs> Yet another iconic spot, the Tampanese Maze Garden! Woo! And guess what? What? This place was also designed by Team Design Architects. Wow, so here you can also raise your friends in a real-life circular maze or even try to navigate your way through the greenery maze. Oh, okay, Zane. Yeah. I'll raise you there! Let's Oi! go! Wait! <laughs> Just 
just by walking around it, you will realise that it is no surprise that our Tampines Hub is Singapore's largest integrated community and lifestyle hub. Yep, it really has everything from a <laughs> swimming pool, a library, a hawker centre and the list just keeps going on. But when you're here, don't forget to check out the community garden at level 5 that features different fruits and vegetables as well as a bird's eye view of the stadium. Wow, just look at all these plants here. It's like having your own garden. It looks so fresh, I feel like eating it. Last but not least, we're at our final location, Tampines Central Park. Opened in the 1980s, green spaces like these were one of the town planning innovations introduced by ACB. And the reason why we're here is to explore their fruit team playgrounds in the shape of mango scenes and also watermelon slices. Talk about a fruitful location. Now that we are done, mm -hmm. everyone's taking this time to upload their best photos onto Instagram. That's right, and I really can't wait to see the three people who have taken the best shots in Tampanese. But first, let's go speak to some of them and find out what they think about this town. Yep. Alright, so I have Geraldine with me here. Say hi! hi. What is your favourite stop for Tampanese Insta My favourite is still the yeah. analog. Analog. TV. Why? Because it's very colourful. It's very nice, let's give it a thing. Oh. So how was your Insta walk experience? It was great. <laughs> yeah. What do you like about it? I like how we got to see many places in Tampines. Mm -hmm. that even people who live in Tampines don't know about. Ah, yeah. That's true, because yeah. you live in Tampines, right? Yeah, I've been here for like 21 years. I I don't know like uh, half the places. Really? Yeah, yeah. So which was your favourite area today? Uh, the, it's the Eco Green Eco Park. Green. Yes, yeah, right. yeah. Okay, Ming An, what is your favourite spot so far? Uh, I think my favourite spot would have to be Ooh, Tampines uh -oh. Street 45. Okay. The, HGB blocks over there. Uh -huh. I, of course, I've never realized that it could be such a good uh, location for you to take uh, photos. Right, John Lim has been doing a couple of insta walks for a very long time now and he's won every single time. Alright, the winner for the best group photo is... <laughs> group! And that's it for another Insta walk. Thank you, MND, HDB, and MPOX for making all of this possible. For more information on when and where the next Insta walk will be, follow MND Singapore and the Smart Local SG on Instagram. Until, Until next, next time, bye! Please come for more Insta walk. <laughs> Don't come just to beat me. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm sweating. <laughs> How does he do that? So I hear myself in surround sound, right? And my mind is blown. Eh? Ah! Wow! Woo. Wow, right? Wow! <laughs> Clap everyone! Yeah.